Hey everybody, Jane here with your 24-7 team. And I thought today might be kind of a fun day to take a ride around the villages to observe the different uh, types of ways to travel in your golf cart. Um, obviously we do go on the roads in some of the areas and in some of the areas there are paths for us to follow. So what I'm going to do is try to show you those different ways as best I can. So the first way is when you live in a village, and that means you bought a home, let's say you bought a home in the village of Duval, and you're in your little area where you bought your home. That area, you literally ride on the roads or drive on the roads with your golf cart and you are acting just like a car. Um, cars shouldn't pass you. Now, unfortunately they do, but they are not supposed to. You are like a car on the road and that's how they are to treat you. So, and I always recommend to get a seat belt in your golf cart because the heaviest part of your body is your head and your shoulders and heaven forbid anything were to happen and you fell out, that's what's gonna hit first. So I always wear my seat belt and um, I'm gonna show you the different ways. So I'm starting out in my little area where I live in the village of St. Charles and I will just video some of the road as we are traveling on it. I'm right as one on the road and I'm traveling on the road just like a car and as a result I obey all of the traffic laws like stopping using my turn signal and here I go again See, I'm traveling just like whoop, that was me just like a car Okay, so that was one way to travel in the golf cart. The second way to travel is when you're pulling out of your village and you're going onto a main road. When you do that, there's going to be a golf cart lane for you to drive in and it will be parallel to the regular car lane. So you are going to pull into the golf cart lane and you're going to stay in your golf cart lane until you find a place where it says merge. And it's gonna say merge because you're getting to either a gate um, or you're gonna to have to cross over the street to get to the other side. So okay, so you can see that I'm coming out of my village and I'm coming onto a main road. See golf carts are coming this way on their golf cart path and you've got another golf cart there you've got a car see how they work together got cars and golf carts all working together golf carts stay in one lane cars in their lane and I'm gonna turn into my lane here and of course the key make sure you stay in your lane. So there are two interesting situations that um, you have to deal with in the villages. One of them is roundabouts and the other is the very main roads. So roundabouts, never, 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 never go in a roundabout with your golf cart unless you happen to have a licensed golf cart that is um, licensed by the state and you are able to travel on the roads. So again, never go in a roundabout. And then the second thing is never get on Buena Vista or Morse Boulevard or 466, 466A, 42, any of the county roads because that's a death trap. <laughs> number one, you're not allowed. It's against the law. And number two, you could be injured because golf carts aren't meant to go on those. Now, that's not to say that sometimes it doesn't happen. Um, probably once in your lifetime while you are a resident in the villages, you may accidentally get into the roundabout. 
If you do, you need to get off as soon as possible. Uh, don't sit there and stop and look around. Get off as soon as possible. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna go back on the main road and I'm gonna get to a roundabout. But before I get to the roundabout, I am either going to turn left or turn right. In this case, I'm gonna turn left so that I can show you the golf cart path. All right, so here we are coming up to that merge like I was telling you, and I'm gonna look behind me. I see nothing coming, so I merge into my lane. And up here is a gate and a roundabout, and I know I can't go in there. So I'm gonna turn left. Make sure that the coast is clear, that no one's barreling through those gates, and then I'm going to keep on going. And now I am on a golf cart path. See how it's separate from the road? It's a specific path, and this path goes north and south the entire length of Buena Vista. And there's one that goes north and south the entire length of McMorris Boulevard. There's the roundabout that is as danger if you get in there on a golf cart. But here we are on the golf cart path and you can see other carts are lying here as well as people walking. So it's a multimodal path, but it's nice and wide and very nice and it runs next to the road. Well, there you have it. There's your brief introduction to traveling in your golf cart as a mode of transportation here in the villages. I know initially it can be kind of scary because you're afraid you're going to do something wrong, but really it's pretty easy. You either travel on the road in your village like a car, or you travel in the golf cart lane on the minor roads, and the major roads you travel on the golf cart path. So once you get the hang of it, you are just going to be living and loving the lifestyle here in the villages in your golf cart. And believe you me, we have some amazing, interesting golf carts. So anyway, I'm looking forward to meeting you and having you coming down and embracing the lifestyle with me. Please give me and my team a call. It's your 24-7 team, 352-205-5379. And let us help you find a place to call home.